the most widely used peripherals in the electricity industry is terminal. The main task of these terminals is to connect two or more wires or connect wires to a component temporarily and it is done firmly and standardly. In the first step, we need to learn how to insert them. To do that, in the schematic tab and from the insert components panel, I select icon menu. As you see, the insert component dialog box will be shown. I'm going to find terminals connectors icon and select it. You can see types of terminal styles and terminal behavior. The circle, square, triangle, hexagon and diamonds are the types of terminal style and the other types with descriptions are available. So I select one of these terminals and then I have to specify insertion point for it. After doing that, a new dialog box will be displayed that makes it possible to edit the inserted terminal. You can enter in the tag strip edit box a tag ID. Also, there is written a tag ID which represents already assigned tag ID to this terminal and you can edit it. In the number edit box, specify terminal number. Now I want to choose OK to see the inserted terminal with the assigned tag and number. To explain the more detail and also edit this inserted terminal, I'm going to use edit component. So I right click on the symbol and then select edit component to open the inserted added terminal symbol dialog box for the next time. As you know, you can edit the tag strip and number and the location for each time that you want, but what I'm going to do is to explain about modify area. In the modify properties area, the add modify button can be used to associate a terminal symbol to an existing terminal. Beside modify button, you can see pick button that makes it possible to select a single terminal to associate. To expand this dialog box, you can use details button to see the catalog data descriptions and the other areas for your particular terminal. Also by using catalog lookup, you can search for another data which you want to be assigned. By choosing details for the another time, dialog box will return to previous appearance. And by choosing OK, you can exit this dialog box.